The next inductee is a young lady from High Point, North Carolina. And I think they're living in Winston-Salem right now. It's Miss Carol Wachter. Carol? Hi, Carol. How you doing, baby? Good. I know. It's a pleasure to have you here, too. Carol said in her bio that she grew up in High Point, North Carolina, and went to High Point Lake and several other of the uh, juke joints around the Greensboro High Point area. And that's where she learned. Said she learned to do the sugar foot before she learned to dance. I don't know how she managed that. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, could I have one or two of those for Daddy? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but what intrigues me is that uh, everyone speaks so highly of the pad at Ocean Drive, which uh, the newcomers so affectionately call North Myrtle Beach. <laughs> Carol said the first time she walked in there, somebody had been knifed, there was blood everywhere, and a tear gas bomb had been set off. Now that doesn't speak too highly of the pad. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, Carol, but I think change, things have changed a little bit, have they not? You think they're going to get back to normal now that the building's torn down? <laughs> right, I do too. But uh, I want to know, did you really fall in love with Rufus Wachter dancing the green eyes? Yes, yes. Did you say yes? Yes. And tell us about that. I decided that... If I ever found anybody that owned two copies of, owned an original copy of Green Eyes, I would marry him. And Rufus owned two. And it was a done deal. Rufus, you lucky devil. <laughs> I should have been collecting records a long time ago. <laughs> now, Carol, welcome to the Shaggers Hall of Fame. You've taught dancing. You and Rufus have for so many years. And I know you, you will be a marvelous addition to our group. You have been very supportive of us through the years. And uh, who are you going to dance with? Cooter Douglas, is that it? She, she's going to be dancing with Cooter Douglas. Okay, Carol. If you'll go down over there, it's easier to get down. Harry, yes. I, w I would like to mention and thank Rufus and Carol and Carolyn Hedrick because they really helped me this weekend in getting all the Hall of Famers lined up to dance. They were a great help. You don't know what it's like when you're trying to put this group together. <laughs> For those of you that don't know Cooter Douglas, Cooter has started his own Shaggers Hall of Fame. He has a unique pivot. It's called a 12-step pivot. And if you don't do a 12-step pivot, you can't get in his Shaggers Hall of Fame. Right now, he's a membership of one, and everybody loves Cooter. I wish Cooter were up here emceeing so I could watch him and have a good time instead of working. But I promise you, it's not work. I love what I'm doing. And I want to thank Carol and Rufus for the hard work that they did putting the dancers together this evening because I promise you, Wanda has tried to do it and keep up with me. Keeping up with me is enough work, but trying to put the dancers together is impossible. And last year, we missed Spider Woman. I'm so sorry, Joe, that we missed you I'm last sorry, year. sorry, Joe. Because I had so many things I wanted to say about those spiders crawling on you. And we missed David Michael. I'm sorry about that. And Tom sorry, Barino. Sorry, David. I don't know. We missed a number of dancers last year because I had a commitment to get Benny King and Lloyd Price on the podium by 12 o'clock. And I did it. And I apologize for that. Now, Rufus, did you pay Cooter? Is that what you did to get rid of him? Okay, good. Go to it. <laughs> 